Okay, let's have a look at my attempt of disassembling the pen cap of the tactile turn gist. I got a new cap from Will Hodge, the maker of these pens, and I'll show you why later. And he told me uh, it's quite easy to unscrew the finial, so I'm gonna try that. He said it's quite easy with um, uh, with a vise. So let's try to set this up so that I don't make any scratches. Following his advice now. Oops. And yeah, the point here is to get the finial of the old, uh, fit the finial and the clip of the old cap onto the new cap. Okay. Nah, that's not tight enough. And try again. Let's try uh, even a bit tighter. If not, I need to get a different um, vise. Nah. <coughs> it's already Papa? far too tight. Papa? Let's loosen it again. Baba? Baba? Okay, let's try it again. Let's try a bit of tissue that's not damaged. Nah, okay, I'll try it with a different type of vice. Just a moment. Okay, I'm back with a different type of vise. Let's have a look whether this is gonna work now. So, let's make it... a bit wider than the finial. Put some paper over to protect the finial. And let's try it again. Not tight enough. Okay, a bit tighter. Of course, I only want to clamp, clamp onto the finial, not the cap. Not that otherwise I make a, a dent in the cap. Oh, Sebastian, let that. Leave that, please. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, very easy this time. Yeah, very good. Hey, Sebastian, don't change the camera. So, let's take the clip out. On to the new cap. Yeah, let's screw it on. Give me a bit space, Sebastian. Thank you. Very good. Let me just change something, then I'll show you what's different with the new cap. Just a moment. Okay, here we are again. This is the old cap. And can you see here at the top? It's not even... Mm, maybe difficult to see. But it kind of pops out. But the new cap... Perfectly round. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye.